Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a brand new season of Medieval Engineers on the Radio Man 03. You can bet it's awesome to have you along. Season 4, the Point Six update came out today on November 21st, 2017. All kinds of great new additions, including this little buzzard right up here. Look at that. Yeah, mechanical blocks coming, so exciting. We've got the wild start. we got the safe area start, which I don't feel like doing being safe. we got the wild start, which is landmarks to explore, and there's no safe area. I like that. And then there's the empty planet. I want to go with the wild start. I think that would be fun. Of course, we're in survival mode. Uh, private, max players four, blah, blah, blah. Auto save is at five. Advanced settings. We're going to go in here. We can take this guy right here. Player inventory size. I'm going to turn that all the way up to ten. Ten. I'm going to turn it all the way up there. Seems pretty fair to me. Uh, it's where we had it last season as well. Nobody seemed too concerned about that. Day duration, 120 minutes. So we got our season duration at four days. 23 and a half is the solar altitude. Da, 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 da. Max objects. I never change any of these things right here. You guys know that about me. It's all pretty... I try to stay very vanilla. Maximum NPCs and things like that. The mods we do put in the game are more of a decor and block type item mods. So it's never anything that's going to increase my resources or anything like that. It's all about trying to be as uh, survival as possible. And uh, that's about it right there. So that's all I can do. And... Okay. Now, at the beginning of the game, it told me that I was using the wrong graphics card for this game. But in here, it allows you to switch back over. So I don't know why it would go to the uh, graphics card that the game came with. or that the, For some reason, it loaded up the wrong graphics card for the game. But I was able to change that around in here. So you can see we're, we're moving around just fine. Oh, it's, it's pretty dark. Over here, we have our quest, the humble beginnings. Looks to me like they want us to gather some resources to make a stone axe. We need three wooden sticks and one small stone. And I'm going to take some berries as well. I am, I, I've been jonesing. Oh, look at the graphics on the grabbing and stuff, huh? Oh, look at this. It's down here. It's like, hey, I'm a stone. You should grab me. <laughs> okay, one stone. Okay, craft one stone axe. I believe if we go to our inventory. Oh, yeah. oh look at this. Look at this. This is different. There's nothing in here for us. Let's do it. All right. We've got it. It's on number one. Number one. Let's go. Let's see. Oh, yeah. We've got the axe, baby. we got the axe. It looks different, doesn't it? It does look different. Okay, what does it want? Find the marked ore vein. Okay, okay. Find the marked ore vein. Oh, it's this way. You can see up on the compass, there's a little pick. We're going to grab a few more sticks while we're at it. Oh, it feels good to be back at Medieval Engineers. I missed it for a few days, you guys. I really did. I missed it. But the, the new stuff is just so exciting, huh? Have you watched the videos and stuff and seen what it is we, we've got here? Are there roots attached to this too now? Oh, there are. Look at that. Oh, beautiful. Listen to the walking. Let's see what we look like. Oh, he's, he's, he's got quite the walk. Oh, there's, a, there's some new trees in here too. Look at this bushy kind of tree right here. F to gather the bush. Oh, wow. Very cool. Okay, so we've got some new foliage in the game. I love the bushes. Look at the stone patches in the forest here, too. We can look around, right? We're familiar with the game. Let's... Oh, what's this here? Oh, what is that? Objective completed. Look at this. This is like... Uh, what is it? Equip stone axe. Obtain two logs. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, I like the way that sounds. Yeah, Keen Software House, they, they, they're, they're trying to make this thing more, far more survival aspect. I think I'm not hitting that right. Let's see. <laughs> okay. thought for a second there was somebody else out here with me. There we go. Right. I forget it's just... Oh, I see. Those are just sound effects of trees. The tree breaking. Let's go ahead and chop it all the way up. We'll take all of it. Let's do it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, there, there's a whole new kind of uh, tree tech system of, of learning things and stuff like that. So that's pretty awesome. Oh, look at that. There's mushrooms over here. Let's get those mushrooms. This is going to be delicious. This is going to be delicious. Okay, so we got that going for us. What else do we need to do now? Uh, oh, it looks like there's all kinds of things. Uh, craft a crafting table. All right, let's do a crafting table. Let's do it. Oh, yeah. Let's eat a few mushrooms, and let's eat a few berries as well. There we go. And we got ourselves one crafting table. It's already down here on the bar. It looks like they're going to have us go through all this stuff here. 
And what do we got now? Q or E to rotate blocks around their vertical axis. Got that. R O shift rolls them. Y rolls them as well. Place one crafting table. Crafting table coming up. Uh, we can't scroll down there on the hot bar. That's a little unfortunate, but that's okay. We'll, uh, we'll do what we know how to do. Uh, okay, press F while looking at the crafting table. And look at all the stuff we got in here. We've got ourselves a bed and all that good stuff. What is this here? Copper ore. Did we get a copper ore just for being a good boy? <laughs> okay. Use logs in your inventory to craft timbers. You'll need them to craft a bed. You can do this in your inventory or a crafting table. Crafting is something... Okay, so it looks like it wants us... Craft two timbers. Okay, we can do that. We can do that. Let's craft two timbers. Let's do that. And let's craft a couple of timbers up. There we go. We'll do that right there. And we should get, I think, four out of there, right? Yeah, we should. There we go. And now it wants us to craft a bed. So let's go ahead and do that. We're going to throw those in there, and we're going to craft ourselves a bed. All right. Nice. Now what? Place one bed. Okay, number four. There we go. There we go. There's a bed taken care of. Claim bed. Huh. Your mind bed. Oh, indeed. Craft four more timbers. All right, let's do it. And oh, voila, voila, voila. Takes a little bit longer than it used to, but that's okay, I think. We're all right. And now what? Craft one small chest. Huh, sweet. Okay, I might as well stop taking those things out of my inventory. What do you think? Hmm, possibly. Oh, we are learning so fast. Look how fast we learn. Uh, place one small chest. Number five. Okay. And consider yourself placed, chest. Craft one small stockpile for timbers. What do we need for that? We need... Uh, looks like we can use any one of these right here. So uh, we could just do that right there. Craft it. Okay. <laughs> and then place the small stockpile. Number six. There we go. Craft one wooden mallet. What do we need there? Need some branches and uh, some timber. Some timbers, okay. We're gonna go ahead and make one of those. La -de -de -de. Hope everyone's doing great. I'm doing fantastic. Been looking forward to getting home today from work to uh, place some medieval engineers with you. Oh, we're gonna stick together. Okay, we're gonna be sticking together on this. Now what? Place one wooden support. Wooden frame somewhere ideal to start building a house. Well, that's just not gonna happen just yet. Uh, we need to uh, we need to move on. We're gonna have to pick up a few things here. Uh, holding down F. Can I not pick these things up? Picking that up. Looks like the the there's a bit of a delay between the graphics and things actually happening. Now why can't I pick this up? There's nothing in it. I should be able to pick up that workbench. There it goes. Oh, got it. Okay, so what do you guys think? This is pretty cool. This is definitely some kind of an ore right here. Yeah, there sure is. Uh, anything else in our inventory that we can craft yet? No, not just yet. Okay, so we're going to move on. Uh, which way should we go? Mm -mm 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 -mm. East, southeast. The sun's going to be setting in the the west so let's head west we're gonna head west yes let's go west grab a little bit of food on our way make sure we have berries in our inventory all that good stuff yeah I don't want to place a wooden support just yet we're uh oh here's some more I think this is is this the aluminum or this is the copper huh it's got that patina look to it Oh, it's really beautiful out here, though. Look at this. I can see snow up on top of the mountains. We've got different flowers on the ground now. Oh, man, this looks really nice. And I guess we've got some new mechanics in terms of how we run as well. You can see him kind of lean forward. He kind of gains speed. That's kind of cool. I like that. We definitely have some new sound effects. nice yeah the bushes are a nice addition it's good to have the different levels of foliage going on I like that idea very much that's very nice so yeah I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna hang out for about 30 minutes I'll stop I'm gonna record another episode another episode another episode and we're just gonna keep going until we find something that we're looking for 
I would love to find some of the new biomes, which I believe we're probably in some of the new biomes right now. Uh, I'm going to get back into first person so I can grab mushrooms up in case we see mushrooms. But we're going to do a little exploring and walking around right now. Oh, you know what we don't have is a club. Mm -hmm. But we're going to be okay. We'll be all right. Oh, look at this, uh, look at this, kind of this gully right here, this little bit of a wash. I like this. This is pretty cool. Come on. There we go. Yeah, I like how this looks right here. More copper, too. Look at the copper in here. I hope you guys can see that all right. There seems to be copper ore. There we go. Oh, you know what? I didn't realize it, but I grabbed that copper ore that was sitting on top of that other one, huh? That other vein that we found back where we were doing all the... The little workbench stuff and everything. Okay, so we've got a little bit of food on us. Not much, but it's enough to get us by a little bit. Be curious to see just how the food food runs. Well, this is very, very cool. So you guys liking it? You playing it, of course? Loving it? Loving every minute of it. Mm-hmm. It's a big mountain off to the west here, huh? Let's grab this little pile of rocks here, too. There we go. We'll grab a few small rocks so we have those in our inventory. It's always smart to have. So now the tools, we're going to have um, different tier of tools that we can make. There's gold, there's copper, there's iron. Uh, what else? Uh, was it aluminum or tin? There's a bunch of different metals. I think I've got this written down. Also clay. There's also clay in the world now, too. Tin, copper, silver, and gold. Tin, copper, silver, and gold. That's that's awesome. That's a lot of stuff. Looks to me like the copper is going to be pretty heavy in the forest as well. So I think we're going to have to go around this mountain. We're not going to be able to go over it. It's uh, massive. Although I have to say, for what we're considering this year's season, you do this year's season, this season, uh, if, we, if you remember what we talked about, we're going kind of fantasy, and we wanted to be uh, up in the mountains and kind of lining the mountainside a little bit. So should we try to go up here and see? Let's see if there's anything up over this ridge that we can look at first. A lot of forest. The wilds. The wilds. So we haven't gotten any animals yet, but we've got the mechanical blocks and stuff like that right now. So, you know, in, in true fashion, Keen Software House, they're always good about giving us updates on what they're going to be doing and stuff like that. So I'm hoping that the Tuesday videos come back and we're going to hear a lot more as to just what's going to be coming. And uh, they may have talked about it in the stream, but again, I was at work, so I did not get to watch the stream. So I apologize for that. So let me know if you know some of that stuff. And I'm going to try to find the stream and, and watch it uh, this evening. All well, these mountains look beautiful. They've done a nice job of changing the way these guys look, huh? Oh, oh. Can we uh, kind of do a little zigzag thing here to get on up the hill? Looks like we can. Oh, there's some herbs. We haven't seen those guys yet. Nice. Come on. Push, push, push. Oh, this is a steep, steep hill. More herbs. We can eat those too, you know. Oh my gosh, this is a, this is a difficult place. We're jumping. We're doing some jumping here, trying to get up here. These trees look almost dead. Like they're really up here in the high area where you can't spring cleaning. Open the general search by pressing G. Oh. Oh, I haven't even looked at this. What do we got here? Toolbar interaction. Search limitations. Blocks and items can be dragged to the toolbar. Okay, that's kind of... Uh, shows an overview of all the houses in the world. Ooh, okay. Blue is Engineer's Guild House. Red is Barbarian's. Okay. Shows an overview of all quests you are undertaking or have completed. Okay. Well, knowledge about houses, storage, and other works of civilian life, economic engineering, civilian engineering, show tree. These are all the research options available to you. Basic wooden house. Unlocks. 
General smelting techniques for producing metal ingots from ores. Start quest. Okay, I see. So this is where we want to get to anyways first, because it looks like we're going to be able to get to some smelting and stuff like that. Or a basic wooden house. Maybe that's what we want. Oh, wow. Okay, so we're actually opening all kinds of stuff here. So if I go to smelting... Can I close that quest? Civil engineering. Economic engineering. Oh my gosh, there's... Hmm. Let's keep walking. The quest stuff we're going to be getting into, of course. But right now, I think we should we should just do a little exploring, don't you think? It's this first episode, just kind of see what the world looks like. Press F to gather from the bush. What do we get from this bush? Sticks. Okay, cool. There's all kinds of different stick options now. It's not just the trees. There's several different stick options, which is pretty awesome. Oh, my goodness. Look at this here valley. Very cool. The trees have got some different colors to them as well. I like that. Think I can make this nice and easy down. Check our map. What was this here? I don't know what that was. It's okay. That's nice that stuff is located on the map so you can see it. So we can always go back to that stuff and find it later. Uh, okay, we're, we're kind of having a hard time climbing up this hill. Oh. too steep. It's too steep for him. It's pretty crazy. This is a really cool wash. I like how they got this lined up like this. This is pretty cool. I thought I heard something. I'm we'll trying not to be in the dark this season. <laughs> okay. And not meaning I don't know what I'm doing. That, that's going to be there, period. You can't do nothing about that. I'm talking about just a little more sunshine in our world this time around. A little more sun. I'm, I'm dying to see one of the deserts is what I'm really dying to see. Uh, even more so than the snow. Since we're coming into winter right now in my area, we haven't had any snow yet, but it's coming. I don't know that I'm too interested in the snow too much. Okay, so we're going to want to build... We're, we're going to do the house quest first. We'll take those care of those, and then we'll get to the smelting part, too. So we'll have that stuff up there. How do I turn those off? You sure you want to abandon spring cleaning? Yes. There we go. Hopefully, I can get those back. If not, I've made a horrible mistake. <laughs> but as we go along, I'm sure we'll be able to learn all this stuff anyways. Here's some more of the copper. Very cool. Nice. Was our inventory bigger? It doesn't appear too much bigger. Maybe it is a little bit bigger. Usually, I think it was, it was five times is what we had our inventory set at. So I think they've doubled how big you can get your inventory to go. If we get up on top of this mountain, it sure would be nice. We'd be able to see a long ways away. Let's go back to our inventory. Let's eat a few things. How much food is that actually giving us? Oh, we found a piece of uh, treasure map. Just by picking up rocks and stuff. Oh, look at that. Food's going right on up. Bam. All right, we're good to go. Yeah, we found a piece of treasure map. What do you know about that? So while we're at it, we're going to go ahead and scoop up some more berries and stuff. Oh, it's beautiful through here. Look how much uh, more foresty it looks. I mean, they, the, the forest at the beginning when I first started playing, which I want to say I've been playing this now for a little over a year. It, it looked good. 
And then they went ahead and changed up the trees and stuff and made them look even better and better and better and better. And it's just amazing how how things look now. I mean, we got all kinds of different kinds of trees in here, and they look really, really good together. Nice working software house. Thank you so much for the update. It looks really good. I'm looking forward to seeing what else you guys come up with now. We got some herbs here that haven't grown yet. Oh yeah, look at this up on top of the world, man. On top of the world. I don't know that I can get up there. I don't know that we'd even be able to get up there. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Watch it. Don't go falling down all the way. Oh, my gosh. I think I might die. <laughs> I think I might die right here. First episode of season four. Uh, that is it. No, 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 no. Oh. Oh, I should be dead. I should be dead. A man and his axe in his red suit running through the forest. What's this over here? Oh, this is a different ore. This is like, like silver or something, huh? Yeah, we're definitely going to have to go exploring to find some stuff. That's for sure. It's not just going to be sitting there waiting for us. Now, here's like an ore vein over here, too, on the side of the mountain. It's not just a stained color on the ground anymore. It's got a, it's got some character to it. Look at this. Oh my God, that is amazing looking. Looks really sharp. I don't think I'd want to fall down on that. It looks like it would cut you up pretty bad. Oh man, this is awesome. I'm gonna do a little bit of running, grabbing berries and stuff on the way. Because remember, you're gonna use your food up with your stamina. Ah, yes. And he was running. We're kind of heading southwest now because this mountain is just so dang big. We may want to turn some of the sound effects down. This is kind of a test run here to see how things go, how they sound and everything else. Oh, mushrooms. Oh, berries. You know, I've not seen yet. I've not seen a deer. You see the pine cones on the ground? Little pieces of leaf litter and stuff? I guess if I started going south, I would run into that thing, huh? I don't really want to go south, though. We're trying to keep the sun up as long as we can so we can have some fun here doing some exploration of the new world. And I gotta say, even though this looks like the biome we've been playing in for a long time, it looks different to me. It definitely looks different. <clears throat> Excuse me, let will sip my coffee here real quick. It was a long day at work, uh, getting ready for the Thanksgiving holiday. By the way, happy Thanksgiving to everybody. In case, uh, for some reason, I don't uh, talk to you on Thanksgiving Day. It's uh, two days before Thanksgiving, but happy Thanksgiving to everyone. I hope you have a wonderful one, a safe one at that. Oh, look at this meadow out here. This is beautiful out here. But we do want to be on a mountainside, right? I mean, we, we talked about that in Season 3 when we were building the Crow's Nest, how fun it would be. There's some wheat. How fun it would be. There's some wheat that's not done growing, and there's some wheat that has grown. We need to build some kind of a mountainside village and really challenge ourselves to be creative that way, and inside and outside the mountain, all that good stuff. Oh, thank you, wheat. Looking lovely. Hmm. Looking for you. How many did we pick up with that? Uh, just one. Okay. And here's a ditch. I love the ditches. This is nice. This is a good addition. This, this kind of terrain right here is really nice. I like this. I like the little red flowers, too. They add a nice color to the to the map. We go west, young man. We go west. The sun will be at our backs, and we shall continue west. Ah, more wheat. Indeed, more wheat. 
Nice. There's some herbs. We'll grab those guys right there because we can eat those. What do we got here for an ore? More copper. Wow, there is a lot of copper, huh? There's plenty of copper. I love the fact that it's sitting out like this and it's not just on a hillside somewhere, you know? It's not just a stained color on the ground. It's got more to it than that. I keep hearing this woof. What's this over here? Rocks. Oh, very cool. Okay, yeah, we're moving away from that right there. So we'll have to go, we'll have to go back. Now, now they've, they've made this so that they, they really are trying to get us to explore and, and get out and about and, uh, you know, see the sights, so to speak. Do we have another piece of the map yet? Just the one. Okay, that's good. That's all right. That's good. That works for me. Uh, maybe I should break away and come back when we run into something different. Uh, what, what I've noticed so far in our episode one here is the mountains have a much more textured look to them. We've got, we've got jagged crags and, and, and different shapes and stuff to them. We've got shadows and stuff cast on the mountains because of overhanging rock and things like that. We have beautiful landscape. The landscape is gorgeous. It looks really great. Ah, uh, the trees. If they kept their moss and stuff on the trunks. The trunks look... Yeah, yeah, they have. They have. The trunks have kept their moss. We've got the beautiful ferns on the ground. The grasses look nice. You get into the forest floor here where you've got these, these uh, you know, coniferous trees and stuff like that. Grass doesn't grow down here very well. So I like how they've taken that in consideration. And the grass starts to disappear a little bit. There's not quite as much because it can't grow because the trees that's underneath are very acidic and it won't let them grow. So I like that. I like the fact that our pine trees now have got some yellows and oranges and reds and stuff in them, rusty colors. You know, it's far more realistic than just like the blue spruce was. So they've really taken a lot of um, time to put this together and make it look just fantastic. Just fantastic. I'm really pleased with how this looks. I enjoy walking through this forest. I love the forest and this makes me feel like I am in the forest roaming about. <laughs> it just, I mean, look at that view. Look at that view, huh? Is that a beautiful view or what? And I just look sexy as all get out in my red outfit. Hey, who put the target on my back? <laughs> you imagine running around out here in the red like this? Oh, look at him lean forward when he runs like that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's amazing. Running fast. He's charging into battle with his stone axe. Oh, indeed. Berries? I think that's a whoosh. Whoosh is what I'm hearing uh, in my ears. That's what I'm hearing. This is a nice little hill right here. I like this one. I do. You could, you know, okay, here's my imagination working right here, you guys, okay? We build our our, 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 our keep up at the top, and then all the way down here, we've got our village that goes all the way down. Kind of like Rohan in Lord of the Rings. How Rohan's set up on that, that knoll, and it comes all the way down, and it just splashes all the way along this mountain, all the way down to the bottom to where we get to the forest right here. That's, that's my imagination right there, going, just going crazy. Are we able to mark the map and say, hey, we like this spot. We want to think about this spot. I don't know that I want to build in the desert. I, I tell you one thing, I, I don't seem to be able to walk up this. He's uh, a little bit skittery. Let's see. I wouldn't mind having some snow or desert to look at, though, right? I mean, that would be pretty cool. That would be pretty cool to have snow or desert off in the distance. Maybe we don't live in it, but we can definitely walk to it. Let's go on up here real quick. Oh, it's not letting me do that. It kind of stops you. Big old wash coming through here. The water would run through here so fast. I'm going to do a little jumping just to get up. That is a beautiful view, isn't it? Maybe the uh, biomes are based on direction of travel. If maybe if we had gone directly south, we would have run into uh, more desert, you know, hotter region. Now that we're heading west, maybe it's going to be just a lot of forested regions. I 
Oh, I don't know. I don't know. But I'll tell you one thing. I will, uh, I'm going to take a little step away here, and then I'll come back after traveling for a little bit more time and see if I find anything of interest, and then I'll bring you back if something happens. Otherwise, I'm just going to keep on running and walking and picking berries and mushrooms and uh, keeping us alive while we look for a place to call home and then get started on the, the, the quests. We're going to have to get started on those for sure, so I'll be right back. Looky here. Our first flax of season four. Oh, delicious. Our first flax. Gotta keep our eyes open for that. Uh, I haven't traveled too far. I've been checking the map regularly, and you can see this green right here. Uh, what is What does that mean? Is that the type of forest or the landscape? It looks like it might be the type of landscape, huh? I may want to head south. I know. Um, we've been kind of going west at this point in time. But uh, I feel like I still want to go west. Now, we've got another big mountain in our way here, so I think what I'm going to try to do is skirt around it and see if I can't get on the other side of it. But I'm fairly certain that probably one of the new biomes is down there. They're, I think they're, they might have a, a, a little bit of a color showing on the map. And uh, we didn't notice that right away, that lighter color. I did not notice it, so... Uh, here we are. We're, we're moving right along. I did find, however, that silver stone that we were looking at is uh, is tin. So we have some tin. We could probably drop that. And we could drop that right there, too. And we don't need all those stones. We'll keep a little little space in our inventory for picking up other st stuff that we're going to need. Uh, keep my eyes open for the flax. Oh, this mountain area up here, too, looks really good. You guys, what kind of a biome do you want to see me build in? Let's let's do let's let me ask you that, okay? My inspirational friends, let me ask you that. What biome would you like to see us build in this season? Huh? I mean, look at this place. This is beautiful. I mean, we could do some really neat stuff here with a building like right here and a building right over here and a bridge that crosses both of them back and forth across this valley right here. It's, it's all kinds of uh wonderful opportunities for us in an area like this. And look at this wash that runs the way through here. This is like a road that travels right through here. It's pretty amazing. Oh, it's, the forest is so dense. I love how dense. Ooh, oh, look out, trees. Look out, trees. Come on now. <laughs> it's, so, it's so thick that you can't get through here. That's really cool. Oh my gosh, look at this mountain over here. Oh, it's just beautiful. Oh my god, the amount of change this game has gone through since the last update. Look at that mountain over there. Oh, man. Oh, I could build right there. All over this right here. All over this right here. It's so glorious. It is so glorious. Amazing. Amazing. Copper right here. We're going to be grabbing this stuff up. I've noticed that each of the veins right now have got a little bit of ore showing on top. And I have a feeling that that, I have a sneaky suspicion that that is intended for us to be able to pick up a little bit before we can actually mine it. We can find it, pick it up, and then make a tool so that we can dig up more even a little bit later. So, although I've not seen any of what Keen Software House has put out in terms of the videos for the game, I think that deduction is probably pretty safe. A pretty safe bet. We're kind of heading west to southwest. Oh, that mountain is glorious, man. Oh, it's so massive. This forest is so dense. It's just incredible. Look how thick this undercover is right here. You can't see but 10 yards in front of you, and then the forest just gets swallowed by the trees. There's so many of them. That is amazing to me. So well done. So well done. Hope you guys don't mind just walking with me. I mean, this is what we did at the beginning of last season. Some people complained, but for the most part, I think everyone was like, that's okay. We're hanging out with you. We're doing all right. Yeah, I, I, you know what? I appreciate that. Never mind. I'm sorry. I brought it up. Let's have some fun. 
Let's enjoy this walk through the forest. It is absolutely amazing. As my guy bounces off of the trees. <laughs> now, where do you want to see me build? We can walk around until we find that. I'm sure some of you have probably flown the map. Uh, those of you who might be new to the channel, we don't fly here. Unless we're just showing the build, we don't do any flying. We're all about survival. Another really cool mountain right over here. Look at the way that peeks through the trees like that. Oh, man, that's cool. That is so cool. This thing is thick. I'm just picking up food, guys. We gotta have some, we've gotta have food with us. That's all we've got available to us right now is mushrooms and berries. I'm pretty sure I could probably get a campfire going and be able to cook up some salads and stuff like that, but we're doing all right. We can we can survive on this. I'll come back. This is a, an amazing forest. I'm I am in true awe here of what I'm seeing in front of me right now. I'll come back when I run into something different. So stick around. Oh, we did cross one road. We did cross a road, uh, but I did, decided not to follow it and just to continue uh, exploring the wilderness of medieval engineers. Yeah. So stick around. I'll be right back. Welcome back. I have found. What looks like a tundra or step or something of that nature and I've just been kind of scooping things up as I go I've also figured out that on the map uh, we, we can go to the different regions and we can see what's in here uh, so here's Darius Darius looks pretty good it's got some snow mountain ranges all the way around it uh, lots of timber all the way around and this here is probably tundra I would imagine of that some sort of you know tundra yeah, Darius would be pretty cool. So I started heading south, and I'm just kind of going south. I kind of figured maybe maybe living near a snow biome would be fun. Maybe. That could be kind of cool on the outskirts of it, and then we've got all that timber. Oh, my God, there's cactus. Do you see this? Oh my gosh, cactus. Cactus fruits. Edible fruits from the Opuntia cactus. We call them prickly pear in Arizona. The pink fruits grow in the cactus body, which grows in desert biomes. They are not very nutritious and increase stamina by a small amount. Oh, wow. Cactus. Cactus. Ha! Huh. Look at that. Incredible. Uh, yeah, I just started heading south. I thought, you know what, we've been going west for quite a ways, and I kept running into what we were running into and not seeing anything new, so I thought, well, maybe what we should do is change direction. I was looking at the map, and then I kind of discovered, well, you can kind of see, you can see where the biomes are, so that's a pretty nice thing. This is really cool, the way the stone mixes with the, uh, uh, the grasses and stuff like that. I like that. I'm going to quick sip my coffee here real fast. Oh, magnificent. Look at this climbing a hill. Oh, we got a warmth and joy quest up here. When hunger strikes, the best way to resolve it is to cook a meal. But in order to cook a meal, one has to have a campfire. Craft and place one, or if there is one nearby, simply interacting with it will work too. No, we're not, we've not crafted any campfires just yet. I want to get up over the top of this. I think I want to head down to Darius. I think I would like to be, we, we know we want to be up in a mountain range because we want our fantasy kingdom to kind of be mixed in with the mountain. But I think a snow backdrop that's, that's a, a, a visual thing for us would be pretty cool. I think it would be very cool indeed. So let's get to the top of this mountain and see what's on the other side. You never know what's on the other side of a mountain. Cactus fruit. What do you think of that, guys? That's pretty cool, huh? I didn't know there was going to be cactus in here. All kinds of new plant life. I think it's really awesome. Oh, boy. Here we go. Oh, 
Oh man. Incredible. I feel like I'm in here. I feel like I am in here. I surely do. Amazing. Amazing. Guys, that's going to have to wrap it up for me for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. We have just now begun Season 4. We're going to do some traveling, exploring, seeing the sights, doing that sort of thing. Once we find that sweet spot, guys, that sweet spot, let me know. What does the sweet spot mean for you here on the game? What would be a good spot? All right, let me know. If you enjoyed today's episode, hit that like button for me. I'm excited. Comment, subscribe, and share. I'm the Radio Man 03. I want you to have an awesome, a fantastic, and a superb day. And I look forward to talking to you again next time.